A welcoming Mel to the hall is artist Gilmore from the class of 2011. Mel Daniels couldn't be here tonight, but he did take the time to record this acceptance speech. Ladies and gentlemen, Mel Daniels. Esteemed Hall of Fame family and friends, I'd like to thank Jerry Colangelo and the ABA Selection Committee for bestowing this great honor on me. All I ever tried to do was my job as efficiently and responsibly as possible on and off the floor. Being selected is truly a great honor, and being inducted in such great company is truly special, especially being inducted with another pacer like Reggie Miller. We'll make this a moment in my life that I will cherish forever. I'm hoping this will be the start of the recognition of other members of the ABA, men who I played with and against, and a special coach and slick Bobby Leonard. The men I played with like Roger Brown, Fred Lewis, who was the leader, Bob Nelecki, George McGinnis. Men I played against like Dale Carrier, Lou Dapier, Willie Wise, Steve Jones, and Jimmy Jones, Zelmo Beatty, and so many others. With Reggie's help, perhaps we together can hold the doors open for these great Pacers and other deserving ABA players. I'd like to thank my mom and father for setting the table for me in a positive way long before I even touched the basketball and my sisters for being there cheering me on. And a special thanks to the man who made me play basketball 51 years ago, and that was Will Robertson, my high school coach. If not for him, I would not be here. He started it all. He forced the love of the game on me. I embraced the passion as I grew to know and understand what it meant to be accountable on and off the court. And along the way, the help I received from Ira Hodge, who started my offensive presence, teammates from high school, college, and pro, coaches such as Bob King and Harry Schmidt, told him to train up from the University of New Mexico, and of course, the one and only Bobby Slick Leonard, and a host of friends and family all over the country. A great special thanks to the one, one of the most humble men ever, Donnie Walsh, who takes the heat when it goes wrong, never the credit for his hard work. And thank you, George Irving, for allowing me to be associated with you guys for such a long time. I also want to thank the Simon family, especially Mel and Herb, for keeping the Pacers in Indiana. And again, the old Pacers for helping me by winning three championships. And the original owners who started the process. And a special thanks to the bas basketball fans that supported us over the years. A special thanks to my wife, Cece, for getting me the job in the first place. I guess I was on the foot. And also a special thanks to my cowboy buddies, long live cowboys. I'd like to remind the audience of the contributions to pro basketball that the American Basketball Association brought to the table. The ABL introduced the three-point shot. The American Basketball Association perfected it. Louis Dapier, Dale Carrier, Fred Lewis, Billy Keller, Rick Mount, to name some men who let it fly. Thanks again for this great honor. Ladies and gentlemen, one more applause for Mel Daniels. <laughs>